What is that mystery then? The mystery moment is in between being and not being. Now, how can we amplify this concept into our Qigong practice then? Why people with the big lumps in the neck through doing Qigong practice almost like overnight disappeared? How could this happen? Because they activated the qi, the intelligence in the body, helping the body to restore back to its original information of the life. And everybody has a cell phone, right? Do you have a cell phone? So when your cell phone is in a mess, what do you do with a cell phone? When your laptop was in a mess, you, you simply just turn it off to have it restore, I mean, the, in silence for like a five seconds or so, right? And then you turn it on, everything back to normal. This is what we do in Qigong practice, in meditation. You give yourself the five seconds. Maybe you need five minutes or five hours to get into that quietness. This so connect you to the serenity. In the serenity, in the peacefulness, Chinese call it Kong, you got every bit of the information of your life restored. That's the moment the body is healed. Now here comes the question. How can we activate this life force, this intelligence then? Once you activate this life force, this intelligence, you can use in any way based on your life purpose, your goal for activating this Qi. Tai Chi people using it, using this Qi to defend, it's very powerful. And Qigong masters use this Qi to perform healing for longevity. At the very beginning, now let's go back to our talk at the very beginning. What is the purpose of Qigong then? The purpose of Qigong is to help you to activate the intelligence in the body to heal, to live a long life. So this is the original purpose of Qigong. Take three minutes and five minutes, just sit down, you know. I tell you uh, uh, my secret, right? So everybody, you can do it by following me. Just say, so you know, sit back. Don't sit back in this way, right? Don't sit back in this way, right? Sit back in like this. You can either sit in the edge of the of the chair like this, and as a person who has uh, meditated for a long time, then you are able to sit like this for a longer time. For most of the people, your spine is weak, so you don't do it in this way. So sit it way way back. The tailbone almost touch the 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 triangle of uh, of the the end of the chair. All right, over here. And sit back like this and put your hands like this or like this it doesn't matter all right just put it here have your fingers slightly open slightly open and the touch touch the uh, the thighs and then now draw your chin back a little and you don't close your eyes yet at this moment <laughs> otherwise you don't see me <laughs> Draw your chin just a little bit like this, like a make it stretch, going upward, right? And then you, on purpose, you drop your shoulders, you pull your shoulders down on purpose. Then you look at me, okay, and just pull it down. And you hold it, not very, very tight, just a little bit resistance there. You know, you, you feel that, all right? You just keep that posture and hold it like this. And then focus on your lower dantian and breathe gently and deeply. Anytime when you have uh, anxiousness, when your mind takes off, you just continue to bring your focus back to the lower dantian. If you feel there's any attention, now at this point you can close your eyes. If you feel any attention, in any part of the body except the shoulders, you let go. For instance, your stomach and uh, your chest and uh, your and uh, your thighs and your your butt and your knees. But the fingers, you stretch open a little bit, all right? Like that. You just keep pulling your shoulders down like that and have your chin jaw pulled up. 
when you hold this posture, I want you to hold it for three minutes now, in silence. Any time when you feel your mind takes off, you bring your attention back to the lower dantian. You don't need to argue, right? Just say, like, uh, bring it back. That's it. Keep pulling your shoulders down and hold it still there. Let go with the shoulders. Let go with the neck. Relax your spine, and that's it. Take a deep breath. Rub your hands and massage your face. 